What's going on guys, Dave here, Anthem Off-Road Wheels. Let's talk about your miles per gallon and how the tires make that impact. So when General Motors picked out the stock wheels and tires to put on my truck, they picked out what was gonna, going to be the most cost effective and provide the best fuel economy because that's what your average consumer wants, right? But let's face it, you're watching this video because you are not the average consumer. You care about the look, you care about the style, and you want your vehicle to do all of the things that you bought it to do and look good doing it. But you also need to be aware, right? Looking good sometimes adds more weight to the vehicle. Adding more weight causes your vehicle to work a little bit harder to get those wheels rolling down the road. Right, but that's okay. So when you're looking at it, just pay attention to which width you're picking up for your wheels. Are you picking out a 33, 12 and a half? Are you picking out a 14 wide wheel? What is going to best meet the needs that you are going to use your vehicle for? So I like to get outside. I like to drive off road a little bit. I like to tow my travel trailer and just get outside with the family and enjoy, enjoy the outdoors. Sometimes that takes a little bit more effort. So when you're picking out your wheels and tires, you need to pick out what's going to best fit your needs. For me, a 20 by 10 on 33, 12 and a half is exactly what I needed for my vehicle. So your tread pattern, right? Your tread pattern makes up a huge difference in how your vehicle is going to perform. If you are primarily using your vehicle off-road and you need that, that tread pattern to get in and really dig into that dirt, then maybe that mud tire is a little bit better for you. Or maybe your vehicle never ever sees the dirt. That street tire might be exactly what you need. But what you really need to do as a consumer is decide what you are going to use your truck for and make sure that the tire you're selecting matches that use. Maybe it's the mud tire because all you do is go off-road. Maybe it's a street tire because all you do is drive back and forth to work. Or maybe you do a little bit of both. Maybe an all-terrain or an XT tire is the right move for you. So tire pressure, if there's one thing that you can really do to your wheels and tires that's going to adjust your miles per gallon, it's making sure that your tire pressure is where it's supposed to be, right? So maybe you air down when you're off-road because you need that little bit of extra traction. When you're back on the street, make sure that you're putting your tire pressure right back to the manufacturer specifications. Just that little bit will decrease the amount of tread that's hitting the road. It will decrease the amount of traction that it needs to push your vehicle along and help make sure that your fuel economy is exactly where you need it to be. So there's lots of different things, modifications that you can do to your vehicle that's gonna change your miles per gallon. Whether you're adding a cold air intake or you're changing the exhaust or anything else, maybe a tune, but you're doing all this stuff to your vehicle. Really, the best way that you can impact your miles per gallon is just drive it safely. Slow on the brakes, slow on the gas, take your time when you're going to get somewhere and save that exhaust for when you really want to hear it rumble and then turn them up. I'm out.